हेलो स्टूडेंट्स आम ज्योति सोशल साइंस टीचर डीएवी स्कूल जाखल वेलकम टू सोशल साइंस क्लास टुडे वी विल स्टार्ट आवर फर्स्ट चैप्टर ऑफ ज्योग्राफी कंपोनेंट्स ऑफ इन्वायरमेंट मेन टॉपिक्स ऑफ दिस चैप्टर आर इन्वायरमेंट नेचुरल इन्वायरमेंट लिथोस्फीयर हाइड्रोस्फीयर एटमोसफीयर बायोस्फीयर एंड इको सिस्टम एज वी हैव ऑलरेडी टॉक्ड अबाउट दिस टॉपिक्स इन प्रीवियस क्लास टूडे वी विल स्टडी इन डिटेल अबाउट दिस टॉपिक्स अवर फर्स्ट टॉपिक इज इन्वायरमेंट इन्वायरमेंट नेचर प्लेस पीपल थिंग्स एट्सेट्रा दैट सराउंड द लिविंग ऑर्गेनिजम्स मेक द इन्वायरमेंट द इन्वायरमेंट कैन ब्रॉडली बी क्लासीफाइड इन टू द नेचुरल एंड ह्यूमन इन्वायरमेंट इट इज कम्बिनेशन ऑफ बोथ नेचुरल एज वेल एज मैन मेड फिनोमिन द नेचुरल इन्वायरमेंट कंप्राइज बायोटिक प्लांट्स एंड एनिमल्स एंड एबायोटिक कंडीशंस लैंड वाटर एयर एट्सेट्रा वेयर एज मैन मेड phenomena comprise the activities and interactions among human beings like roads bridge etc environment environment originated from french word environer it means neighborhood anything that surrounds any living organism is called environment components of environment natural environment atmosphere sphere of air hydrosphere sphere of water lithosphere sphere of land biosphere living things sphere of living things human interaction individuals family society religion education political situation economic these all are human interactions human made things parks buildings bridges roads industries monuments all these are the components of environment you can see in this picture components of environment component of environment are divided into two categories natural environment and human environment as i have discussed before the natural environment refers to both biotic and abiotic condition existing on the earth it consists of lithosphere hydrosphere atmosphere and biosphere human environment the human environment refers to the activities creation and interaction among human beings human environment now we will study in detail what is human environment human beings interact with the environment and modify it according to their need with time human needs grew and became more varied humans learn new ways to use and change environment they learn to grow crops domesticate animals and lead a settled life the wheel was invented surplus food was produced barter system emerged trade started and commerce developed barter system means exchange of things industrial revolution enabled large scale production transportation became faster information revolution made communication easier and speedy across the world the natural environment anything surrounds any living organism which was not made by human is a part of natural environment anything surrounds any living organism which was not made by humans is a part of natural environment both biotic and abiotic are included in natural environment biotic means living organism abiotic means non living organisms 
द नेचुरल इन्वायरमेंट इज़ क्लासीफाइड इन टू वेरियस डोमेन्स लिथोस्फियर हाइड्रोस्फियर एटमोसफियर बायोस्फियर Now elements of environment physical environment and biological environment there are two type of elements of environment physical environment and biological environment physical environment the physical environment includes all non living things like water land and air biological environment the biological environment includes all living things such as plants and animals now we will study in detail about the domains of environment as we have discussed before there are four domains domains of environment lithosphere hydrosphere atmosphere and biosphere lithosphere lithosphere means sphere of land the solid layer of the earth is known as lithosphere it is the solid crust or the hard top layer of the earth it is made up of rocks and minerals and is covered with soil it has various landforms such as mountains plateaus plains etc it provides us land forests grasslands and minerals hydrosphere hydrosphere means the sphere of water the domains of water the domain of water is known as hydrosphere it comprises of various sources of water in rivers lakes seas oceans etc it is very essential for all living organisms atmosphere atmosphere means sphere of air a thin layer of gases it is the thin layer of air that surrounds the earth it protects us from the harmful rays and scorching heat of the sun it consists of number of gases dust and water vapors biosphere sphere of life plants and animal kingdom together make the biosphere or the living world it is the narrow zone of the earth where land water and air interact with each other to support life atmosphere plant observe carbon dioxide the main climate altering gas and produce oxygen instead dead leaves and plants add nutrients to the soil insect and animals burrow helping the soil breathe trees and other plants slow the flow of rain water of rivers acting as natural flood control the biosphere is a sphere of life what is ecosystem all plants animals and human beings depend on their immediate surroundings and are interdependent on each other this relationship between the living organisms as well as the relation between organism and their surroundings form an ecosystem threats to environment threats to environment means anything that can disturb our natural environment for instance man made things such as fumes are polluting the air land is being consumed to build factories these all are the threats to environment because these pollute our natural environment 
थैंक्स स्टूडेंट्स लिसन दिस वीडियो केयरफुली एंड ट्राई टू सॉल्व द क्वेश्चंस गिवन इन योर बुक एक्सरसाइज